Terrebonne General Medical Center is taking aim against heart disease, the number one cause of death in our state, as well as the leading cause of death in the United States. Louisiana, surprisingly, has the fifth highest rate of cardiovascular disease in the country. Each year, the foundation for TGMC holds the Take Aim at Heart Disease clay shoot, engaging local sporting shooters while raising funds to support heart disease treatment and research. And welcome to the show. So very glad you are joining us tonight. However you may be joining us, I want to introduce to us on the set, Paul and Chuck. Thank you all so much for being here. We very much appreciate it. All right, let's jump right in. Paul, what is the Take Aim at Heart Disease clay shoot? This and I think we've got some photos that we want to show with this as well. Great. This is a program we, uh, the foundation started three years ago. There was a problem, or we know there's a problem with heart disease in our community, and we wanted some means of fundraising for mm -hmm. specifically for cardiovascular care. And this is our third annual Take Aim in Heart Disease clay shoot. And we thought that the title, the uh, marketing department came up with the title, and I think it's a great name for it, Take Aim in Heart Disease. I cannot disagree. And we've got some shots right there of those people doing that, taking aim. Some of those people from last year, is that right? Last yes. year, right. It, we turned out a lot more fun. Chuck and I had never been to a, uh, a play shoot before. Okay. And the, from the first year, we just thought, this is a fun event. <laughs> right. We've determined to do it again. Yeah, some of the doctors there, see? Correct. In our shot, very good. Uh, and I appreciate y'all coming to the set and uh, telling us about it without bringing the guns. Yes, right. Uh, but we did also, bring clay shoots. Bring we did bring shoots. a gun. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we have clay shoots. We're hoping not to shoot them. <laughs> and so speaking of when and where we'll be shooting, Chuck, tell us when and where the shoot's going to take place. Okay. I know you call me Chuck, but my name's really Jay Walker. <laughs> Jay Walker. Jay's the chairman for this event and is an out of town, so okay. I, Paul and Jay asked me to pinch hit. So it's fun being Jay Walker. He's much younger. Jay Walker pinch hitting is yeah. Chuck. Yeah. Very good. Well, thanks no. for being here and explaining this to us. But, uh, Jay? These are the clays. We brought some for decorations. This is what they really shoot. You know, mm -hmm. Some people call them pigeons, but they're clays. And this is what we shoot. And the only thing is they're really hard to cook. You know, you got to really ball them a long time. I know, Paul, you're a great cook, but I don't know how if you're good enough to cook these. No. But, uh, but a good onion gravy to make them taste real good. Okay. But uh, the, the shoot is coming up within, within about three weeks from the airing of this program. It'll okay. be April 11th, Saturday. Saturday. And it's a pretty much an all-day event. We're gonna, we probably will reach our goal of 20 teams. We'll have two different flights. We'll have a morning flight that starts at 9.30 a.m and probably takes about two hours, we've learned. Right. And from about 11.30, 1.30, we have a lot of activities, anywhere from good food, a lot of generous people cooking and donating. We'll have uh, silent auctions. We'll have uh, auction boards okay. for uh, prizes, and we'll have live auctions. Um, you know, one of the auction board items this year is uh, uh, we're going to have a, a, a hunt for a fallow deer uh, at Grand Coteau, uh, Bobby Bugaris, three day hunt and two nights for a trophy fallow buck. And oh my. That, that is, uh, you know, people go all over the world to do something like this and they'll okay. be able to do that really right here within about 10 or 15 miles That's of right. Homa. It's a, it's a, it's a, this is a best kept secret. Well, it sounds so like that. It. Uh, Mike Fake donate, donated a um, aluminum utility trailer, huh, Paul? Correct. Well, look, there's a beautiful shot of it right yeah. there. Yeah, oh, there it is. Hey! Mm. So uh, that's, <laughs> that's donated. That's really nice. That's going to be auctioned also. And so uh, that was very generous. And those are some of your big items, but then we'll, we'll go all the way down to, you know, raffle tickets, you know, for five for a dollar or something. But, you know, we'll have a variety of uh you know of prizes in, mm -hmm. to be won but the two flights um the second flight will start at 1 30. okay and the event takes place uh at the tri parish sporting clays and then we say jewel street on bayou blue okay but, um, if keith if i can i'll age myself it's right on the side of Doolin and Edwin's. You know, when we used to go there That's for That's exactly right. That was I some think, of the best crawfish yeah, in the area. Yeah, right. So too. when I say that, well, oh, I know where that is. Right. You just go right down the line, the lane right there. 
And we do a great job, right, Paul, in marking it and signage. We'll have, you know, clay shoot signs and marking and and letting the, people know where yes, that is. We'll have it very okay. organized. Sean, put that back up if you don't mind. I want to show people exactly where that is. A Saturday, April 11th, 2015. Again, it's an all-day event. Uh, it, it's called Main Shooting Times, but it's two flights. Correct. I'm to understand. Right. Uh, Ten, for someone ten teams on each flight. On each flight, 9:30 and 1:30. And again, it's the Tri Parish Sporting Clays on Jewel Street in Bayou Blue, next to the former. Dulan Edwins. And so we've talked a little bit about that. Chuck, can you tell us how people can participate? Yeah, it's in interesting when that question came up, how you can participate, and there are a lot of ways you can participate. Okay. You don't have to be just a shooter. Okay. Uh, I compliment TGMC as an example. It takes at least, what, Paul, 50 people. Volunteers. Volunteers just to operate the clay shoot. Wow. I mean, between tickets, raffle tickets, gate. Uh, there's 11, 11 different shooting stands that take two volunteers to be scorekeepers and judges at every of the 11 shooting post positions. Yeah, well, that's 22 people yeah. just right there. Oh, exactly. I mean, it just, okay. it takes a good 50 people or mm -hmm. more. And uh, to a large degree, a compliment to uh, TGMC because last year, I don't know, we brought some pictures of that, but they showed up in strong numbers and, mm -hmm. and they, they were the majority of mm -hmm. the volunteers. And it sounds like uh, that Paula said they're excited and it sounds like they're coming back. They had a great time last year. They want to come back again this year. It was nice to be outside to do an event and the employees, Team Terrebonne, that's what we call our volunteers. Right. Team Terrebonne did a great job showing up and supporting it and they're ready to do it again. So. I love it. And then it. just if you're watching Team Terrebonne this year at the shooting stations, we got you 10 by 10 tents so you can get out of the rain or the sun. Last year we let them out there get hot yeah, and wet. Was, yeah. but, so we're, we're, we did get new station tents. So we're excited about that. So we're going to protect them a little bit. Well, I tell you what, gentlemen, we're going to take a quick break on that note with all the help and support and the number of people that it takes to put this on. And when we come back, we're going to talk a little bit more about this upcoming event, the uh, Take Aim at Heart Disease Sporting Clay Shooting. And we'll be right back after this short commercial break. Don't go anywhere. Even after six decades, Terrebonne General Medical Center has never lost the genuine compassion that inspires our exceptional care. We've been here in your most urgent moments and when you need to set things straight. After all, our dedicated doctors and nurses and staff are proud to call this community home. At TGMC, the innovations of today take on new life tomorrow. All right, and welcome back to the show again to your health with TGMC. I have Paul Labatt and Chuck Weaver here. Uh, Chuck, you were talking about the different ways that people can participate. Why don't you tell me a little okay, more about that? Other than the great volunteers, the other way exactly. to participate is that if you would be a clay shooter or want to put a team together, and when let's talk about them putting a team together. This can be a, a female or a male. It could be a youth that has a hunter safety card and, and, and with a guardian parent present. Uh, so, I mean, it can be a family event. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, it, it's, so there's a lot of shooting participation in there. Okay. Uh, a lot of people, the young Y Heck team is guided up by Jeff W. A lot of those Jeff those w. young people outshoot a lot of people. So mm -hmm. there's a lot of different types of people participation. Okay. If you notice when we show slides and pictures, it's, mm -hmm. it's male, female, and youth. Right. But other ways to participate, if you may, and you can participate on that in the form of teams. Okay. Um, four men team is a normal team. Okay. And if you want to do all the events, all the different types of shoots, and that's anywhere from a five stand to the 11 stands to the, uh, the Longbird to the Flurry, a four man team, $750. Okay. If you want to do just 11 station shoot, which is about 100 clays, correct, Paul? Correct, correct. 100 shots each. It's about a 100 shot uh, event, mm -hmm. That that's 550 for that. Right, and that's for each team member. It's 100 each, shots for each team member. Each correct. team member, correct. yes, sir. Thank okay. you, Keith. Sure. And bring your own shells. Or oh. if you don't have shells, uh, the range has shells for sale. That they can purchase. They can okay. purchase them at the correct. range, 12 gauge. Correct. 
So that's 12 gauge in case somebody shoots 20, they need to bring on 20s. Okay. Other ways to participate, we have t-shirts that for the event and you can get your name on a t-shirt. Paul, I believe that's for about a hundred, $250 for 250 for a t-shirt. You can be a station sponsor of the 11 stations for 150. We'll have signage made mm -hmm. for, for the, uh, the sponsor of that station. Uh, you can be a you can be a food court sponsor for five thousand dollars if you want to be the major food court sponsor. Uh, the gun sponsors, they're just unlimited types of prize sponsors because uh, this is competition and in, in the competition we will award prizes and we'll talk later on about the type of prizes right. okay. that we have. And then people can also involve themselves in a two-man frenzy and that's 25 clays. Yes sir. By the long, blur, long bird which is five clays which is a two-shot single gun and then mulligans. You got to love that. Yeah. You got to love the option for a mulligan. We determined it'd be twenty dollars. Correct. For a mulligan. Okay. And, uh, for for those a mulligan is if you in your hundred round sh sh shoot, if you hit ninety eight <clears throat> out of a hundred, you can buy two mulligans for the misses, and they they represent misses. Okay. And you can buy two extra shots for twenty dollars. And so you can make your perfect hundred out of a hundred. I love it. Which uh, yeah. I would love it too. Anybody could do it. So that it just makes it fun. You you mentioned the uh, the the long bird. You know that's shooting. You know at what he seventy yards from what we understand. Correct. The frenzy is two people. Let's say Keith and I up mm -hmm. on a tower stand, and they're just throwing twenty five different clays all over, left and right, left and right. And, uh, and we, and you just load and shoot, load and shoot, and just keep it moving as fast as you can. And a shooting frenzy. Uh, now, they don't put us on opposite sides of each other, right? No, you can okay. be side by shoulder <laughs> by shoulder. Just check. Yeah. Yeah, I'm teasing, of yeah. course. And, uh, and it's just the idea is hope you shoot, I'll be loading, I shoot, you You'll be loading, be loading. Gotcha. rather than the clays flying out and nobody shooting. You I know? gotcha. Which happens. Sure, yeah. sure. You know, it's, it is a, it's, it's a fun event. It's not to be uh, taken serious. It, this is a fun event for mm -hmm. a fun ra fun fundraiser. Mm -hmm. And just the idea is just come out there and have a good time. And yes, and it's really fun to miss. It. You, okay. It's, uh, Jay Walker was telling me, he, who's done this his third year as chairman, was telling me it's like, well, if you like golf, you'll sure like this because it's it's there's a lot of a lot of misses and a lot of mulligans. A lot of misses, and then you can pay for your mulligans. <laughs> right. I like it. And so, Paul, let's talk a little bit about where the proceeds from the event go. Well, the good thing about this event, 100% of the money goes toward cardiovascular care. There's no oh, overhead it. taken off. We don't send money anywhere. There are all kind of programs. I think everybody in Terrebonne Parish knows someone who is affected with some type of heart disease. Sure. Uh, that's my father passed away from heart disease. Right. I mean, and everybody knows somebody. And right. this, all the money stays here. It works with local physicians, local programs, local uh, equipment that has been bought by the proceeds of the last fundraiser. Right. So this year we hope to do even more and all of it's going to go toward cardiovascular care. I love it. Now there's something else going on. The program called the Structural Heart Program at TGMC where the funds from this event are specifically designated for. Can you tell us about that program? Yeah. As you know, I'm not a medical person, but I could tell you about it. I could sure, read about please it. Please do. Uh, provides treatments for valve disorders and structural heart disease, heart, heart defects. Mm -hmm. uh, we're the only program at TGMC in the southeastern part of Louisiana. So this is mm -hmm. the place we've partnered, of course, with the people from Cardiovascular Institute of the South. They're some of the leading cardiologists in the country. Sure. Uh, the local cardio, uh, cardiothorac surgeons. Cardiothoracic. Yes, right. thank you. No problem. Provide this life-saving procedure for patients with heart valve disorders and structural heart defects. These physicians use minimally evasive catheterization procedures to cardiovascular disease and pioneer innovative techniques to treat life-threatening uh, heart diseases. So it really wow. is specific for a specific program. Very good. And as we uh, we round up the show, we've got about 30 seconds. How does the foundation support our community? Well, we're the we philanthropic arm that. of Terrebonne, Par Terrebonne General Medical Center. Right. I mean, it's, we're the, the arm of it, but it's the people in the community who give toward programs. We've given toward the Community Sports Institute. We've right. given toward diabetes education. We've given toward the blood bank. 
uh, just a whole host of organizations we've given to programs at Terrebonne General for the health of our community. Wow, fantastic! And of course, rooftop. The rooftop you do a roundup lot of that has work. always been very successful. Right. Uh, the uh, the heart and soul run. The uh, Super Cooper run for neonative, neonatal intensive care unit by the Fontenot family. Right. They've done a tremendous amount. I love it. And so it's, it's just so good to see us really focused on that. Now let's uh, let people find out if they want more information about the foundation and the take aim at heart disease, they can go to Terrebonne General Medical Center. Uh, again, uh, the foundation there, register for the event at, event at TGMC. Go to www.tgmc.com slash foundation. Or for more questions or information, you can call 985 Eight seven six four six one six. That's nine eight five eight seven six four six one six. Well, I got to tell you, thank y'all for bringing the, uh, did not bringing the guns, but only bringing uh, <laughs> those to be shot. I appreciate it, and uh, we appreciate y'all being here. Thank you for what you're doing, and we're really hoping to have a lot of people go out and enjoy this wonderful activity. We'll see you Saturday, April eleventh. Saturday, April Keith, April eleventh. You support. You thank got you so it. much. Keith. Absolutely. Thank y'all. All right, that'll do it for us with To Your Health with TGMC. Stick around, we'll be right back after this commercial break.